World Water Day is celebrated internationally each year, and this year, the lead team at the Water and Sewage Department, in conjunction with the Conservation and Fisheries Department, held a celebration in the Noah Loy Positive Action Movement Park on March 22nd under the local theme, Better Water, Better Jobs. Acting Deputy Secretary for the Ministry of Communications and Works, Mr. Jeremy Hodge, highlighted the importance of water in our economy and the role of the Ministry of Communications and Works. Here is what he had to say. I asked myself, where does the Ministry of Communication and Works fit in all this? I said, well, the Minister for Works had set out a clear vision that supports our growing economy and population one which by insisting on incorporating best practices in wastewater management. And this is taking place in our modern wastewater treatment facility at Boat Point. Tortola, where sewage from Purcell Estate through Prospect Reef is being treated. At our wastewater plant, Effluent is treated to the tertiary level and safely discharged. Therefore, best practice in wastewater management is a reality in the Virgin Islands. I think that deserves a round of applause and a chehu and hello! <laughs> hello! This means a safer, cleaner, Virgin Islands environment for sailing, swimming, enjoyment, and other water-related activities that support a vibrant tourism industry, the industry which provides the most employment and self-employment than any other in the Virgin Islands. While we walk toward the vision of an efficient water distribution network that will model best practices in developed countries which includes minimal water disruptions, the Ministry of Communication and Works encourages everyone to conserve and to keep us abreast of any leak leakages of water, low pressure you may experience. And last, last but not least, to our men and women who go unrecognized that maintain and upgrade our wastewater management system and water dis distribution network. Thank you. Water is vital to our environment, and as guest speaker and representative for the Special Project Unit at the Ministry of Communications and Works, Mr. Keith Smith stated, water is an essential building block for life. It's no coincidence that whenever the Bible refers to water is really is in relation to life you know you have certain parts like in ezekiel where they say so everything will live where the river goes water is an essential building block for life water is a, is a core for sustainability water is um, water helps with, with renewed energy water helps to the environmental sustainability um food energy Everything relies on water. <laughs> but although water covers most of the, the earth, 97% of it is salt water, 2% of it is locked in ice and glaciers, and only 1% is available for human consumption. So we have a water crisis. Mr. Smith also brought meaning to this year's local theme, Better Water, Better Jobs. Now, today's theme, uh, for 2016, as you mean, the theme is Better Water, Better Jobs. This year, this theme focused on the central role that water plays in creating and supporting good quality jobs. Water is one of the industries where there are a lot of career opportunities. Today, half of the world's workers, 1.5 billion people, work in water-related sectors. Moreover, nearly all jobs, regardless of sector, depend directly on water. 
water is life. The UN data shows that by 2050, the water demand is projected to increase by 55%. Annually, due to, goes due to the demands in manufacturing and thermal electricity and um, resident consumption, they expected a 55% increase in water. This is a place that we can emphasize to produce work for the population. Now, locally, we have a lot of infrastructure, infrastructure in terms of water. We, we have productions, plants to create water. We have a distribution system that transmits water all over the place, and there are a lot of opportunities. We even have opportunities in the wastewater sector. Well, this current administration noticed this need, and uh, this year, water is one of the top priorities for the administration here. We just put online a wastewater treatment system that's putting clear, above standard effluent water into our outfall. And we just hired local people to run, operators to run the plant. There are a lot of other opportunities in water. We have environmental opportunities. We have uh, operations and maintenance opportunities, customer service opportunities. So water, water is one of the one place that a person can come in with an entry level from five degree and work the way up. We have opportunities in engineering, civil, mechanical, electrical, controls and instrumentation, just some of the list of opportunities that's in water. Director of the Water and Sewage Department, Mrs. Perlin Scatliff Leonard, elaborated on how water really affects jobs. Now I'm going to elaborate a bit more to what Mr. Smith said, because he's stuck on the water sector. This is his, his um, forte, water sector and the sewage sector, but I'm going to spread it out a little bit to jobs outside of water and sewage department because the reality is without water, many of the jobs in the BVI, many of the jobs in the entire world could not operate without water. And I'm just going to list some of them and you'll see where I'm going. Where I'm going. We have restaurants. Can they operate without water? We have the road works that are public works department um, execute. Can they operate without water? No. We have our agricultural department. No. We have the electricity cooperation. No. They need water, believe it or not, to produce power, the power that we use, and we rely on them too, so we go hand in hand 50-50. Yes? We have the clothes that we wear on our backs, the very shoes that we wear. We have the cars that we drive. The drive. We have the, those fancy glasses that we wear. We have those nice rings, those nice um, jewelry that we put on. They all need water in order to be available to us. So you can see how many jobs are impacted. The day commenced with several exhibitions and displays from both private and public groups. World Water Day is a collaborative effort between the Water and Sewage Department and the Conservation and Fisheries Department. For more information about the Water and Sewage Department's outreach efforts, please contact Ms. Carlin Scatliff at 468-5830. I am Information Officer Nikita Turnbull. Thanks for tuning in.